Hello everyone. Today I will discuss one of the important topic of CSI net syllabus that is morphogen gradient. So what is morphogenesis? Morphogenesis is 3D organization, shaping of the multicellular body and organ. So what is morphogen? Morphogen is a diffusible biochemical protein that can determine cell fate by its concentration. So what is the morphogen? Morphogen is a diffusible biochemical protein that can determine cell fate by its concentration. So it can be acts as a transcription factor. It can be a paracrine factors. What are paracrine factors? Paracrine factors work in a short distance in a nearby cells. Suppose this is a cell and in the para during paracrine signaling they will work in the nearby cells. It can be secretory factors, morphogen present within the cell. Example, retinoic acid, FGF8, fibroblast growth factor 8, vertebrate body axis formation, helps in vertebrate body axis formation, BMP or bone morphogenetic proteins, help involved in mesoderm formation, sonic hedgehog, vertebrate limb and digit formation, this may be a transcription factor. So, morphogen may be a transcription factors. it can be a transcription factor, it can be a paracrine factor, it can be a secretory factor, morphogen present within the cell cytoplasm right now next is so morphogen actually gradient play important role in developmental biology so morphogen gradient how the morphogen gradient so source of the morphogen in the source which cells it is will produce the source the concentration is high in the sink the concentration is low so source cells here the concentration of the morphogen will be high in the sink cells here concentration of the morphogen will be low and during intermediate condition here the morphogen con concentration will be intermediate now here also a threshold value it will work so morphogen actually they made they maintain their concentration gradient in proximal region proximal part they will be in the source where they, it will be high concentration intermediate in the middle concentration and low concentration it will be low in the sink region it will be low in the source here proximal part here high concentration intermediate in the middle con and in the low concentration in the sink or target region so that's actually morphogen. So morphogen actually gradient provides a very important mechanism for conditional specification. The existence of morphogen gradient as as a force in development and regeneration region in, in, in case of regeneration you know can be specific predicted by the Thomas Hunt Morgan so first you can see that here the source these are source cells where concentration is high intermediate here middle and low here concentration of morphogen in the sink region this can be explained by French flag analogy model French flag analogy model this is a French flag analogy model where the first is the blue region blue region then white region white region and this is the red region according to French flag analogy model this will be source source where concentration is high in the source region where concentration is high these are the source and these are the sink and always there is a threshold concentration always there is a threshold concentration threshold
threshold concentration this is a gradient of morphogen and these are sink so source cells here concentration of morphogen is high source cells here concentration of morphogen is high and below a critical up to up to a particular threshold it will increase the morphogen concentration high and it will develop in the blue color cells in the second when the below threshold level this is a threshold for blue threshold for blue cells this is a threshold for white threshold for white cells threshold for white cells this is a cell color now this is actually known as french flag analogy model according to french flag analogy model louis ulpert illustrated such a gradient such a gradient of positional information positional information using the French flag analogy model using the French flag analogy model French flag analogy model Imagine a row of flag cells. Imagine a row of flag cells. Imagine a row of flag cells, each of which is multipotential each of which is multipotential multipotential each of which is multipotential capable of differentiating capable of differentiating capable of differentiating capable of differentiating into a into either either a red a white or a blue cells or a blue cells 
then imagine a morphogen whose source then imagine a morphogen whose source is on left hand eddies left hand eddies of the blue stripe of the blue st stripe and whose sink is at the other end other end of the flag the flag on the right hand eddies of the red strip stripe on the right hand eddies of the red stripe a concentration gradient is thus formed a concentration gradient concentration gradient is thus formed concentration gradient is thus formed the highest at the highest at one end of the flag tissue of the flag tissue and lowest at the other and lowest at the other the specification of multipotential cells is accompanied accomplished by the threshold concentration so threshold concentration threshold concentration play important role concentration play important role important role threshold concentration play important role cell sensing the highest concentration of morphogen become the blue cell sensing the highest concentration highest morphogen concentration morphogen concentration become blue then there is a threshold morphogen concentration below which cells become white then there is a below th below the, this threshold the cells become white and as the declining the concentration of morphogen falls below another threshold the cells become red so these are the cell for threshold for white cells and below the thresholds the big cells become red below the threshold of the blue cells cells become white and this actually morphogen gradient that as the declining concentration of morphogen falls below the threshold cells become red according to this model is known as french flag analogy model this model is known as french flag model french flag model of morphogen gradient of morphogen gradient French flag model.